She is also part of this group. Uh, but is this anybody's first time to plan an ant? Yeah. Oh, perfect. Okay. I can do the thing. Uh, so, Plan Ant is a 501c3 nonprofit. Uh, and <laughs> that scared me, clearly. And uh, it basically provides a space for people like me to play with smoke machines uh, and do some really fun stuff. So, there is shows like this, there is uh, sketch comedy. There is uh, improv comedy. There is stand-up actually located in the back. Uh, there's uh, bands around all the time. So if it can be on a stage, it can be here. Uh, so we appreciate you coming and supporting things like this. Uh, like I mentioned, we are Ants in the Hall. Has anybody ever been to an Ants in the Hall show before? Yes! yes. So we're a little different on the fact that there's no script for this show. Uh, we have ideas. We write them down. We need to get from point A to point B. But the in-between is kind of up to us. Now, if we like something, we might repeat it. If we don't, we're going to change it up and see what happens the next time. So every show is going to be a little different with some similarities as well. Um, so yeah, so that's our unique little way of doing things. Tonight, we are doing a film noir romantic comedy. So hopefully, you like those genres. And uh, yeah, I think that's about all I have to say. Stick around after though for Stupor because that is another great show. And uh, Woo. yeah, Woo. <laughs> with that, I take you to Hot for Ham Town. It's 11.24 in Hamtramck, Michigan, sometime in February of 2024. It's just past the witching hour, just inside of Evil's Bar. That's the homicide squad of the newspaper men. A murder has been reported. A detective, a young up-and-comer who met his match. In a traditionally Polish town, you might expect polka and yenny, but tonight, it's a sour state of affairs. Ask the Kraken Kielbasa. If you want to find the answers, you need to be hungry for it, like this here detective. But he found the taste was so sweet. <clears throat> uh, Chief Amici, a quick question from the press. That is Amici to you. Oh, sorry. Uh, redact that statement. Amici, uh, first question. Yes. Uh, why are you touching the dead body without gloves? Because my mama never washed her hands, and neither do I. All right. Next question. Okay, next question. Um, is it true that the uh, victim uh, died uh, guzzling on that Kowalski over there? It is apparent that the victim died guzzling on that Kowalski. I can't help but feel like you are wasting my time, reporter. All right, all right, all right. One, one last question. Is it true that the victim was a sex freak? <laughs> Between you and me, it is true. He was a bit of a freak in the sheets. Now scram, it's an act of a crime scene.
again. Front page of Hamtramck Times, boy. Poochke killer strikes again. Dead bodies found with Poochke stuffed in the mouth. I've had you on this case for a year now, and you haven't delivered me anybody, anybody yet. Chief, you gotta give me more time. I, I, I can feel it. They're gonna strike again, and I'll be there. I'm gonna catch them right in the midst. Do you think I like being humiliated like this? It says Donnie down in the dumps, Chief Stanko in the stink. Nobody puts me in the stink besides my wife where I like it. <laughs> and listen, I asked you for a suspect, and who do you bring me? My very own cat, Senior Biscuits. I'm just saying, he's looking real suspicious these days. Chief, come on. Ah, you're on the strike the radio. <laughs> ah! Listen, it's the dames. The dames are what are getting in the way. Every single time you you were supposed to investigate, and all eight of my daughters, you married them and divorced them in the span of 24 hours, which I don't even know is legal. Chief, you can't discriminate me for my medical condition. You know I have ADHD. Oh, I tell you what, you're lucky that I didn't throw senior biscuits into the slammer. Because only one person makes biscuits on my belly every night. If I throw him in the, in the slammer, you better be coming over every single night, boy, and making biscuits on my belly. <laughs> you understand me? Yeah, I read your loud dreams, boss. Now get your head in the game and don't let any games get in the way. It's been easy as a detective. Every precinct so far has sent me packing, because they don't like what I'm packing. <laughs> I'm a little trigger happy. I'll admit it. Sometimes you gotta do what needs to be done. Sometimes your hands get a little dirty. Sometimes they get a little wet. No, not like that, you pervert. <laughs> but this is the law. It's a 17 strikes and you're out kind of deal. And I'm on 16, so I gotta make this one count. Even the detectives hear me wave their fingers one too many times. I'm all out of good favors and black and mild. And the night is young and I'm feeling good. And to help clear my thoughts, I figured I'd head to the old watering hole. The old bar. I don't know. Coffee shop closed down that we usually go to and Don't even talk about it. I know. <laughs> I'm very sorry. <laughs> this my is, date. I know. And this is the only bar that's open at two o'clock on a Wednesday, so here we are. Hey, hey, what do we got here? Three girls, what's your order? One cup? <laughs> <laughs> It's 2024. That metaphor is so old. Oh, I can't be that old. Like, what year is it from? 2005. Yeah, yeah that sounds about right. Oh, uh, 2005. Hey, you millennials got any friends that were born in 2005 that you want to bring in here sometime? Ew! Uh, exactly. They literally couldn't have a better yeah. age. Well, it would be 19. <laughs> I mean, just, uh, it's fucking half tramp, okay? 19 year olds can drink it half tramp. All right, what the hell are you going to have? Oh. Like, um. Well, I would like a Cosmo. Um, I'll have a uh, rum and coke. I'll have um, a Manhattan. All right, three five skis coming right up. What ski? Wahoo! What? What? Um, Order. Um, any anything. Get a beer. Okay. All right. Why have I met you? Yeah. <laughs> can show himself off. Uh, well, ladies, since we're here, mm -hmm. I figured we would just, you know, talk about this hot bumble date I'm going to go on tonight. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I know. Yeah. 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 
no, it's been a long time. Well, only three months since Paul died. How did he, how, how did he die again? Yeah. Well, the coroner said he choked to death on his spittle, which is totally natural causes. I mean, oh, uh, that's yeah. fierce. It happens. Yeah, yeah. Well, they have a way better, more definitive science term for spittle, but that's, that's I don't remember. Okay. Yeah, 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 yeah. 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 Hey, uh, sorry, we were all out of Taiski. All we got is idiots. I don't understand anything you're talking about. <laughs> it's all right. Let me uh, lay some knowledge on you, if you don't mind. By the way, uh, sweethearts, my name is Ivar Stahovich, and I am the hardest working Polish American man in this town. And let me tell you something, all right? With all this news about this Pushkin killer, I just want to say one thing, okay? Back when the Polacks ran this joint, you know, before they moved out to Sterling Heights, <laughs> you never saw any of this death by pastry bullshit. Are you flipping us off? Yeah. No, well, I'm just pointing. It's normal. <laughs> oh. Sure. This is how people point. Uh, I mean, yeah. specifically Polish American people. Oh, well, I apologize. You kind of got to have this slight tremor to it. Like, oh. Yeah. <laughs> You're doing a fantastic job. A fabulous uh -huh. point. Wow. I just really thought you were saying fuck you and we uh -huh. are going to pay you for these. So. Yeah, well, uh, I like to say fuck you in another way and that's uh, I don't take no orders from no women. So uh, if you need anything, uh, don't. It's 2024! Ew! <laughs> Know what just happened. We're gonna have to find another bar. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> wow, it really is but unfortunate. Talking about the death by pastry. Yeah, the pastry yeah, the punch back. killer. You ladies, I mean, it's been what, like three months since the last one. It's fine. Mm -hmm. He's not gonna come get us. We're safe. Maybe it's a they them, and like they're really progressive, and now we've just labeled it a man this whole time, and maybe we're the bad guys. Alexi, you seem really overconfident. I mean, I haven't pissed off anybody recently, have you? I would never piss off any. Okay, well then you're safe. You're totally safe. But, but you I never know. We go like, on dates. Yeah. Okay, the last time you were on a date, Clinton was in office, and <laughs> you said something last time we spoke about, like, COVID really fucked up your flow or whatever. <laughs> I mean, it was a serious issue. Yeah, <laughs> we couldn't go on dates because of COVID, and we didn't want to get sick. Yeah. <laughs> anyway, guys. What if the killer comes after one of us? Dating in 2024 is so hard. You swipe left, swipe left, swipe <laughs> left. That's what you got to do now to find love. Maybe you'll be the one, so you take a chance to swipe right. Maybe you'll be the exception to your rule. Time to get back out there. Maybe give this guy a try. I have to get ready for my hot bumble date. And here come my bestinies, Bethany with a Y and Bethany with an IE to help me pick out an outfit.
So you're sure you haven't seen a guy named Josh in here? He says in his profile he's 6'2 and weighs 180 pounds. He has, he's got blonde hair and blue eyes. And he, he had a lot of pictures of him with fish and, you know, just holding a fish out by a dock. Like that's like supposed to entice women or whatever. No, but he sounds cool as hell, huh? Okay, here you go, Monica. Thank you. Nah, sweetheart, I didn't steal your hair, but it seems like you can't keep the two poop away from both these boys. Dupa beats ass. I hate that. I'm going to leave. No, I just figured you would have seen a man in here because you care so much about them. Yeah, 6'2", 180 pounds per his profile. Uh, blonde hair, blue eyes. His name is Josh. Maybe he introduced himself. I just don't get stood up. It just doesn't happen. So. Well, I mean, I, I've been here for a while, and I haven't seen any attractive men in Hamtramck at all. So. Yeah, it has been hard. I don't know hard. if that's a thing. <laughs> oh, by the way, I'm sorry. My name is Monica. Monica, hi. Hi, I'm Alexi Hatlipsky. Nice to meet you. You, I, I just, you know, I've, I've been dancing in this bar ever since I was eight, <laughs> and I just, I, I just know Ham Tramick, and I just, I don't know if you'll find somebody that that, that's tall or attractive. There's plenty of blonde-haired, blue-eyed guys that are in Ham Tramick. No, I think they're just visiting. Like, you know, I'm going to go outside for a smoke. If you want to have a little nip, that's okay. You know, like you, you like, know, like, like off the whole bottle? Yeah, that's fine. It's fine. <laughs> I mean, I don't believe in COVID, so it's cool. <laughs> and by the way, you should really watch yourself around these Hamtramck guys. They're ugly, and sometimes it can be very dangerous. So be super careful. Okay, okay. thanks, Monica. You're welcome. No. Oh, 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 Is anybody assisting here? Uh, yeah, I- Happy to hear it! You literally didn't let me finish <clears throat> saying that I'm waiting for someone, and I'd love it if they would sit right next to me. Oh, I'm so glad I did. Uh, Do I look familiar? <laughs> Are you the Jets Pizza guy? Am I the Jets Pizza guy? No, I'm a meat you got, damn it! Try again! <laughs> oh, you know my improv troupe gets pizza from you every once in a while. So, you are familiar. Uh, okay, it's, it's okay, pizza, you know, Thank like, you. for a budget. High or, praise. Uh, 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 sure, yeah, if that's what gets you going. It does, it does. Tell me, have you ever wanted a pizza pie in your oven? Uh, oh, <laughs> no, actually, I've been more of like a, no, I'm not even going to flatter and enlighten you with what Please, happened. flatter and enlighten. I am truly so busy that I don't open your pizza box. I don't want to know what's inside it. That is the scariest looking box I've ever seen in my life. And personally, I don't think there's anything in there other than... That is my own blood. <laughs> I am uh, not interested, so if you could kind of... Oh, okay, no pizza, just the me. Get the fuck off! <laughs> and maybe I could just go on with my day. I've already been stood up and I don't need a very scary Italian man. Okay, life. okay. Hey there, a kiss or goodbye? No, thank you. Oh, I've got a kiss for you, buddy. And what's the that? <laughs> I got a kiss with a piece of goodbye. What? Oh! <laughs> Right? I'm gonna toss you out of here like one of your nasty pizza salads. <laughs> oh, you can't do this. Step to a meat. Get back in your other civic car. Oh, <laughs> You'd be lucky. <laughs> Sorry about that. No need to apologize. That was very attractive. Uh, uh, no man's really ever stood up to another man like that for me. Oh, can't see why not. I I don't. No, oh. either. Sorry, I'll be there. Thank <laughs> you. Oh, um, well, this, 
Oh. oh. <laughs> Thank you. Is this like our our meet cute or whatever they call it in the TV? Oh, I wouldn't know. I'm vegetarian. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, you can call me Don. Donnie Diamond Street. I'm Alexi Hadlipski. It's really uh, nice to meet you. The pleasure's all mine. You um, look like you could be a cop or something. Very close. I'm a detective. That means I always get to the bottom of every crime. Oh, I've got a bottom you can get a hold of. Uh, I mean, um, is that a Kowalski in your pocket, or are you just happy to see me? <laughs> I went in the e-hole thinking I would clear my thought, but something about that name really turned my eye. I couldn't stand to see her accosted by that disgusting pizza thing. That ass kicking was a late delivery that he had. But as I wiped the grease from my fist, we locked eyes, and my heart got twisted up in a fushiki knot that no sweet old babka could undo. But if this is a bakery, then my heart's in the air. And my dough had closed. <laughs> job was mid. She put a lot of work into that. That's all those jobs. But with a little more practice, she can make a real career out of it. I can't 
can't think about that now. I've had 16 strikes with the four, 16 positions with this bra. <laughs> but the chief's right. I got a job to do, not a blow job to destroy. Ladies, as fate would have it, my bubble date never showed up last oh, night. Oh, no. But no. don't fret. Don't you fret. I met the hottest detective you've ever seen. Oh, what? Oh, oh my God. God. A detective? That's so hot. And we went back to his house. And, I mean, the things that man did to me, I just couldn't believe it. But then he threw my clothes at me like, oh. Like I was just some trash that had to be picked up by Joseph Combo. Oh, oh no! <laughs> that's sorry, you know. Men are the worst. Are the absolute worst. Ugh, the worst. Mm -hmm. This one time, I went on a date with a guy, and I thought that went really well. And then he called me up and told me he was like living in a tent in a park at Troy. Oh. <laughs> oh, oh, this one time I went out with a guy. His car broke down. That's okay. That happened. And then he asked me to walk home. Oh, this one time I went on a date with a guy and he actually brought three other girls there and then they all ganged up on me and, and they drew on me like what was wrong with me. Oh. oh, this one time I was dating a man for three years, serious relationship, talking about marriage, and then he ghosted me. Oh. And this was like 2009 before that oh. was a term. Yeah. Original yeah. ghost. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Oh. Thousands? That's great. Yeah, that's really yeah. 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 Like no, a that's lucrative thing to do. Oh. So what you want? Well, but I, I was charging a dollar each. It should be a one. <laughs> Wait, that would be a, a thousand. Yeah. That's, Lead kicks? That's yeah. A lot oh. of time. Yeah. Um, I think you just need to up your rates. Yeah. Yeah, maybe like a thousand per pick instead of that's a thousand great. picks. Even like five hundred dollars, so it's like you only have to send two. Oh, yeah, because there's like lots of girls who make it their career, like they own homes and stuff off of like meetfinder.com and just travel. Just travel. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, you ladies seem to know like a lot of stuff. Like I really wish that I could just you know like not work here and just like just have beat picks and like do all that kind of stuff. You, you can't. You're not, you can't, can't smoke, smoke in here. here. This is indoors. Yeah. <laughs> so what? <laughs> Why not? <laughs> what? Um, I know it's like Camp Tramic, and that's like the cool thing. It's like you could smoke inside, but like if you could not, maybe right in front of us. Oh, yeah. I didn't oh. know I was with women that are woke. <laughs> I mean, yeah. I, yeah, I, yeah, yeah. I, I, you know what? I, I don't think you should even have my booze. I was going to give you some, but not, not. I'm going to take this outside and chill. But you, you can't, can't like, drink outside. Go, yeah. so I'm going like to. Because. You ladies are poo-poo heads. <laughs> <laughs> wow. That was, um, Queen of this is. That was a shown under sight. Uh, oh, B-Horse. Can I have one of these B-Horse specials? <gasps> Give me a special. Make it three. Make it yeah, three. Yeah. Uh, yeah, there's two with that B-Horse special and on. You can give me his cups with the shadow. Get to drink the shot, so these specials come right up. <laughs> Are you gonna be okay? That was a lot. Yeah, stole that, stole that. Yeah. <laughs> this is when it got stole, stole. These specials I hey, wait a That's second. The same. I don't wait. Where the, where the hell's my dancer? Where Monica go? Hey, Monica. You get your ass back here. You don't take no water from no women. Hey, Monica, oh, sweetheart, where'd you go, baby? Monica. Uh, I don't think hey. she went on her own accord. Uh -huh. yeah. I don't know, ladies. We could just go back to me now. That would be nice. Always. Oh, oh. Yeah. Um, I just think Donnie is the one. The one. 
I can oh, change no. him. I can change him. <laughs> um, you're a strong, independent woman, and you deserve a better name. Yeah, and you're so good at taking things into your own hands. Yeah. You know what? <gasps> you, you don't, don't need, need a man. man. I just don't think I've ever found anyone I click with as much as you click with Johnny Guy Whiskey. We just seem to fit. We get together like peanut butter and jelly, like ants in a hall, like sour cream and applesauce on the pierogi platter of love. <laughs> wow, wow. I said it. I love him. I, I love him. I love him. Mr. and Mrs. Johnny Dyminski. Mr. and Mrs. Dyminski. Mr. and Mrs. Donnie Dyminski. Love the Dyminski. <laughs> XOXO. Donnie and Alexi Dyminski. You're cordially invited to the wedding of Mr. and Mrs. Donnie Dyminski. Merry Christmas and happy holidays. Love the Dyminski. Maybe we'll live happily ever after. I wonder where we'll get registered after our wedding. What if we get that nice little ranch with the white picket fence down the street? I wonder how many kids we'll Mr. and Mrs. Donnie Dyminski welcome their second baby in the paper. I wonder what our kids are going to look like. Maybe they'll look like him or maybe they'll look like me. Love the Dyminskis. She left me. Huh. She left me, Chief. Thank God she took the cats, because you know we couldn't have any kids, so we just had cats. And she took the cats. How evil is that? I know you would hate that because of your snore biscuit. <laughs> hey, you're not talking too much, Chief. You drinking a little bit? I will tell the wife I'll chop the piss out of the wife. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I won't tell your wife though, I swear. <laughs> Gather candy. <laughs> <laughs> hey, you okay? Know me when I meant to see your piss and you light right up. You all right, Chief Oh, God! <laughs> oh, oh, oh. Not the chief! Oh, God. Uh, uh, what do I do? Uh, uh, I gotta call somebody. Uh, uh, oh, God dang, how do you work these dang things? I hate these things. Stupid phone. <laughs> Hello, this is Donnie Dyminski. Hello, Detective Dyminski. You gotta come down to the station, please. Oh, geez. I'm already here. <laughs> oh, God, that was fast. That's right, it was. Um, God, I didn't want to tell you like this, Donnie. Well, I'm sorry about Edith. You know, it wasn't my intent for you to find out that much. Uh, oh, wait. What were you going to talk about? <laughs> what were you going to talk about? Okay, never mind that right now. There's something you called me about that was apparently way more important than that. What? Chief! Oh, no! Oh, 
Oh, my dear sweet daddy figure. Oh, <laughs> oh, oh the boots get hurt. The night is me. Was that the, the rigor mortis that we did? What's happening? I don't know. He's prone to those sorts of spasms. <laughs> oh, my God. This might have been his last one. Oh, my God. The boots get killer. What does he mean? I don't know. I don't know. Oh. No. All I heard was his lunch. <laughs> I swear I didn't do nothing. I, was, I, I just I came in here and he was. You did like, this. Nope. Nope. <laughs> nope. Wasn't me. Where? I see you got jealous over Edith. Now I get it. Why you gotta go there, Johnny? Why you gotta beat up an old man who's already down? <laughs> Maybe I'm sorry, but. I just you gotta rip off that band-aid somehow. Look, all I know is that you're the last man here with this body. If I had any other sort of uh, understanding of the law, then I'd know that you did it. That, that doesn't seem quite correct. <laughs> Listen here, Danny. You're gonna tell me you did this, or I swear to God, I'm gonna pulverize you. You're, you're gonna beat up an old man? That's elder abuse, okay? I don't think so. I'm pretty sure it is. <laughs> I didn't do it, okay? I would never do it. You know that I love the chief. I love him like my son, just like I love you like my grandson. Even though you didn't know that. Now I feel extra bad. <laughs> yep. Danny, I know we got a lot of history, but this doesn't look too good for you. You gotta give me one piece of information that'll that'll clear this all up and clear your name. I can't have done this. I'm I'm little, but I'm old. I'm old, Dandy. <laughs> the dirty man with the broom had a lot to say. Something didn't matter. Old Dandy likes to clean up the floors around here. But I'm here to dig up the real dirt. Chief was like a father to me. He was cold, distant, and he never hugged me. At least he went out the way he loved, eating a sweet pastry and smoking a stogie. But I have much simpler taste. So it was off to E Halls to drink the paint. I keep reading it. I, it's never going to change. We're going to so order something and give it to the beer. Yeah. Uh, whatever. You know, ladies, Donnie hasn't answered my texts or my phone calls, and I know he's got that goddamn rotary phone, but you think he'd just answer. That's just rude. That I, is just... I'm over him. I'm going to focus on my career. I love I, that. Oh, my God. Yes. 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 Wait a second. We let women have careers now? Actually, ladies, I got a job for you. All right, because women always be shopping. Now, Pope John Paul II <laughs> oh my God. wore this hat when he came to Pope Park here in Antrim. Now, uh, how much do you think that this would be worth on Facebook Marketplace or the Ebays, huh? A dollar. <laughs> so you're focusing on your career. My, <laughs> my career. career. Yeah. <laughs> oh, oh, you guys, um, did you hear that the Poochie Killer got the chief? <gasps> <laughs> this I actually kind of okay Yeah, that was okay. That. He probably deserved it. Yeah, I, that guy's a piece of shit. Yeah. <laughs> he zombified himself. Yeah. And then right. was like, alive oh, for a second, huh? Oh, oh, you're dead. You're, you're dead. 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 Idiot. Yeah, what an idiot. Trash. Oh. 
Ah, é. E aí, probably really deserves it, you know? I mean, to be fair though, I am still scared of Pookie Killer. Yes. Why? Why? Because it's a killer on the We're young single women. We should be scared of men. I think we should like wanna biologically rap ravage them. That's like what I mean, want. yeah, we all want to get fucked, but yeah. I also don't want to die. Yeah. Okay. Well again, back to what I said earlier. It's not like you've made anyone mad recently or upset someone that's really close to you. So what what's the point in being upset? We're back here to talk about me and Donnie, and now I'm going to focus on my career because he hasn't answered my text or my call. Oh. I do love that still. So. Yeah. Thank yes, you. I think that's We're a great idea. So Always in on love. I, wanna, that idea. I don't know, like maybe move to Montana or like Wisconsin or what? Massachusetts and like what? go where all the men like dress like lumberjacks and think about Christmas all the time and cut no. down trees. I, and not a lifetime movie. I want to see. I've got to go. Um, um, we'll call you all up. We're going to check it. Yeah, we're going to have to check it. Uh, <laughs> oh my gosh, what are we going to do about our best friend, Lexi? Uh, her name's Alexi, yes. and she's her our best friend. friend. Yeah, I knew that. We're the Bethany's. Yeah. She's Bethany, and I'm Bethany, but I'm Bethany with a Y, and she's a Bethany. I, yeah. yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah. What, yeah. What, what does Alexi do for a living? Oh, that's oh, great. It's, it's a great it's career. Good. She has such a great job, career. Totally pay attention. Totally know what she does. Um, I think uh, an influencer. Yeah. 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 She, <gasps> no, no. She opened that TikTok shop. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. It's yeah. kind of like an influencer. Yeah, yeah. But, but, but like you also have oh, to sell. I mean, it, or, was it an Etsy shop? Or was she doing vintage antiques on eBay? You know what? I'm not sure what she does, okay. but I know that she um, makes a lot of money. Yeah. Oh, and she sets um, her own hours. Yeah. Oh, yeah. 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 She'd be great. Yeah, yeah. She's so good. Oh, I know what that is. A sex worker. That is so oh, cool. Uh, no, I oh don't gosh, think that's that so, good. like, very 2020, you know, pandemic-y. Yeah, everybody <laughs> was stuck inside doing OnlyFans. I totally understand. No, I, I gotta get ready for my next I don't think before, that's what she does. She's I Oh, okay. I hate that I love him. Why is it every time I fall for someone, they can only see things in black and white? But I love him. No, I hate him. No, I love him, but I hate him. No, I love him. Maybe I just need a distraction. Maybe I need to focus on my own career. Every time I think I'm getting close, Pookie Phyllis slips right out of my grasp. 
Watcha, you stupid attack fraud! Learn how to walk in heels. How dare you look at your heels? I swear! I like them! Actually, they're pretty nice. Thank you. Where did you get them? We'll talk later. Okay. Smoke break? Bye bye. I swear to God, Donnie, if you were a woman walking to the car, you listen. I don't think no one is just no women. I swear to God, if there's a woman walking up to this mall right now, I will denounce my Polish American heritage. Let me tell you, I will never. Oh, son. <laughs> is the seat taken? It will be so. Happy to hear it. Corne, Le Day, Donnie Dynasty. <laughs> Thank you. Pleasure is mine. That mark will go with the others. Mm. So, what brings you here, Donnie? <laughs> uh, work, I'm afraid. Oh. I'm tough on a case. I'm a detective, you see. Hey, I've got something you can work on. Oh, do you? <laughs> <laughs> that is fun. <laughs> I'm afraid. Tell me more. Don't you care. <laughs> I have to be ready for work at all times. <laughs> Somebody's got a temper. Maybe a temper pedic we could both lay out? Maybe. Let me just check something real quick. Ow! Make a wish. <laughs> More time with you. Yeah. I wish for your number. No, thanks. I'd love to get to know you more, but, uh, I'm afraid I've got important business to do. I've got to catch a punchy killer. All right, well, call me. Hmm. Maybe. Until next time, Horne. I hope it comes sooner than later. Oh, I come when I want. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Ehor, I'm ready for the special. Yeah, lucky like for you, Ehor doesn't serve women in this bar. Luckily for me, I'm a lady. Ugh. Horne Lede. Charmed, I imagine. I'm Alexi Hotlipsky, and you can keep your hands to yourself. I just wanted to warn you and tell you that Donnie's mine, so. Oh, for now? You might as well just back off. Okay. Pretty simple. So are things getting pretty serious? Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. He's going to ask me to marry him at any moment. Oh, really? Yeah. But he hasn't popped the question yet? Maybe some... he's found someone else? Yeah, some men just take their sweet, sweet time, you know? Oh, I think I'll make it happen a little bit quicker. I think you better just keep your parts to yourself, miss. The day. <clears throat> Whatever. You know, again, Donnie's mine, and I don't want to see anything bad happen to you going after a detective and all. Oh, I'm sure he'll protect me. Yeah, he's after a really big murderer right now, oh, don't you know? Is he? Mm -hmm. I hope he has a little time left at home. I'll be there. Oh. That's what I was implying. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. A broad such as yourself seems like more of the type to go fix her lipstick in the bathroom and hmm. shake random strangers' hands and maybe flaunt her things all of them. <laughs> <laughs> well, maybe I will powder my nose, hot Lucy or whatever the hell it was, <laughs> but not because you told me to. It's taking you a hell of a time to get to that goddamn bathroom. Occupy. Oh. Every time I go in the new palace bakery, I can never decide on my food tree bed. I like them all. Raspberry, lemon, strawberry, custard. The full baker's dozen. Just like with the names. 
Maybe I shouldn't have gotten the horned lady's number. Maybe I shouldn't have done it in front of that first day. My eyes got too big for my stomach. Man, I really hope I didn't mess up that blowjob thing. That was a real sweet gig. Maybe I need to make it up to her. Wait a minute. What's her name again? Well, as luck would have it, I caught Donnie here the other night with a woman with her legs spread all over him and her ugly garter belt, and she was flashing her pussy to every last man, woman, and beast <laughs> that was in the 30 mile radius of Camp Shannon. Honestly, this bar is just so gross, and I don't know why we keep coming back. <laughs> Donnie. Yeah, Donnie. that's fucked up. Um, wait, <laughs> guy, is that again? Is that the one who left you at that ski resort and then you had to try and find your way back from Colorado? No, Parker ended up getting me an Uber eventually. Oh, it was the lawyer who brought a contract to the first date. <laughs> no, that was Graham and we don't talk to him anymore. Oh. oh. Was it the coroner who brought you in and then he wanted you to have sex with a dead body because that's what he was into? No, but Mike was into some other really interesting things. Oh, was it the one who made you buy a hundred tacos? Oh, wait, nope, that was Lee Meyer. I solved my own problem. Yeah, not that one. <laughs> Johnny. Johnny. Oh, wait. Was he the one trying to solve the Poochie Killer case? Yes. Okay. The one that, yes. Closing. Yes, and that was just, you know, a little blip in our relationship, okay? It doesn't mean everything, you know? Um, just a quick, though, like, he was trying to solve that yeah. Poochie murder case, and we really need him to do that. We do. It's made dating very difficult. I can't look at a man without wondering, is he pure and kinky? <gasps> that, that ain't no Poochie. Oh. <laughs> Sir. Here's some styles to give you a towel. You have pastries here? Yeah, now? we would like some. Oh, uh, ladies, y'all. We play a little bit of a game here where uh, you come real close to my lips and you tell me. No, never mind. Go away. Nope. Is this Bye. Or no. Or just for Bye. You know what I'm oh. <laughs> I'm the only one who can spread eagle my man at New York Bar. She thinks she can take my man? What, after two fingers of Yeji and, I don't know, a PBR? Dirty, low, down, ugly bimbo. She should know that Donnie's mine, that that's not an option. <laughs> I have a feeling she does. Tell me again how you found the bus. I told you everything. I, I went to the restroom and I panicked and I drug the whore out here. <laughs> yeah, that seems like a super normal thing to do. I'm sorry, I freaked out. I don't know, I'm not a cop. I don't know what to do. Yeah, but it looks to me like you might be the killer, making an excuse to get your fingerprints all over the body. No, I, I, I really did not want to touch her, but I drug her out here because I thought she would look better. <laughs> Speaking of, you're hysterical. Oh. Get a hold of yourself. Oh. Makes you look ugly. Oh, no. You know what? I, I told you everything I know. I just, I gotta get out of here. I just, I can't, I can't even look at her. And I just, oh, God. Go on, take a smoke break. I will, oh, oh. Yes. oh, Horne. What happened to you? 
we could have had a lot of fun, you know? Just you and me and these powerful games. <laughs> what a shame. Good broad gun to waste. The things she could do with those feet and those heels. <laughs> we'll never know. <laughs> Monica! No! Oh, no! Oh. Not another poochie! Normally I'm the one that makes them gag. First it was that dame, horny lady from the mod. Then it was Monica Hahn, the burlesque dancer. Seems like every dame with a good working mouth gets it stuffed with a punchy. The killer's getting closer to my heart. Alexi Hot Lipstick could be next. I need to warn her. I hope there's still time. Getting really freaked out. Did you? I mean, like literally, everybody is dying. <laughs> Left and right, like literally right there and there. Lady, yeah. if it was an active crime scene, there would be big yellow tape. We wouldn't even be allowed to be here. I'm sure you're safe. We need to get back to the problem at hand. <laughs> and that's that. I think Donnie's gonna propose any day now. Oh, oh what? any day. He's just been so busy with this murderer, and I know he—I know he's thinking about me. All right, Alexi. Uh, we've been talking. Yeah. <laughs> and um, you're delusional. You're so delusional. Oh, yeah. Me. Me. Yeah. I'm you delusional. Up once or twice. Maybe it was two or three, and then sixty positions later. That's love, bitch. Don't you know? How many dates have you been on, Alexi? Enough. With, okay, with him, with Donnie, enough to know that he's the one for me, and I am not changing my mind. Okay, okay, but the thing is, we say this because we care about oh, you. Oh, yeah, yeah, friend. yeah, yeah, yeah. My best friends would fucking call me delusional, that I'm crazy, and I've got something going on, and maybe he's not the one. Okay, we're getting way too heated. We're getting way too heated. We just care about you. We just love you yes. so much. You're right. You're right, and you're right. I'm sorry, I was being delusional. You know what, ladies? I forgot. I have something in my car that oh, I wanted wow. to give you. Okay, okay. I'm just gonna go out to the parking lot. Okay, okay. I'll be right back. All right, we'll okay. be here. We love you. Love, love you. you. Love you. Oh so my. Yeah. <laughs> I'm gonna scare you for a moment. Yeah. She does that. Tell oh. your uh, friend. Better not bring your old feminist shit back into this bar. You know? <laughs> hey, uh, what even is feminist shit? <laughs> what, like, is it a manifesto or something? I don't know, like Gloria Steinman's autograph or something. <laughs> what, do you think? what do you think? Now Monica's uh, kicked the bucket. Uh, you think I should be dancing around here? Ew! Oh, gross! <laughs> Are you okay? Stop drinking all your own products! <laughs> Weird. It's so weird. Also, it's so weirdly quiet. I don't like it. Let's let's oh, do the jukebox. Yeah. yeah. Okay. You know about Alexi though? Yeah. It's dusty. Uh, yeah. yeah. What's in here? I know. I'm gonna keep looking. Okay. But yeah, Alexi. Oh, yeah, sweetheart, the jukebox okay. only plays the Polish Prince, Bobby Vinton, Sammy Hagar I'm... era, Van Halen, and Toby Keith. Rest in peace, legend. <laughs> I just sure. so oddly specific. So Alexis, she like she like does this thing where she's like <laughs> insane and then like she calms down and she's fine. Yes, she goes somewhere. Don't know where. Don't and know. Then she comes back. She's, normal. she's normal. I don't know. It's like I don't know. I just don't get it. But so, Toki Toki Keith, Polish um, something. I don't you know what? Maybe we just spin it. Oh yeah, my bestie is. Yeah. What if you turn around so I get to surprise you? Okay. <laughs> Thank you.
<laughs> How could they say all of that? Really? I'm delusional? My destiny? They don't even care about my love life anymore? <laughs> they don't have a love life anymore now, do they? <laughs> Time to go get my man. so sticky oh and covered in clays um but I it's already been a few days since we last never mind Johnny <laughs> I've washed my hands since the last time we <laughs> made well anyway that's disgusting that you would think it's for residue <laughs> shouldn't have tasted it but it's sugar so I win <laughs> but they lose <laughs> Kill the pooch, you kill her. Oh, Donnie. Alexi. I just figured it would bring us so much closer together. There's so many of them. And I know you're the one for me. And we can move away to Montana or Wisconsin or Massachusetts. And you can wear these suspenders and they look so good on you. Don't be ridiculous. Those are Republican states. <laughs> There's no way I could go anywhere where abortion isn't commonplace. <laughs> you should know better than anyone. <laughs> You're right, Johnny. I just, you know, I thought our love was gonna, you know, bring us closer together. And, you know, you'd catch me and I'd be like, oh, she's just, oh, she's just a little out of sorts. And, you know, she really cares. And The only you know, thing coming together is your hands in the pair of cups. <gasps> but, Johnny, Johnny, no, you don't have to send me away to that big lady's. Gail and Jackson. It's so far away, you never come visit. Lexi, I've got to put you in the big bad broad house. I'm sorry. It's got to be this way. But a detective can never be with a criminal like you. You're a murderer. Well, you got me there. <laughs> Duh. But maybe one last kiss before you send me away. And then I'm kissing ladies the rest of my life. God, that does make me real hot. <laughs> no. Some people have just gotten a little too close for comfort. Oh, Donnie. Well, what were you saying about my blowjobs, Donnie? Hmm? You'll never have one now, will you? <laughs> I'm gonna miss you, Donnie. But you know, it's all over now, isn't it? It's all over now. <laughs> that means, you know, that's why I don't think no orders of no women. <laughs> <laughs> Thank <laughs> you.